How's it going everyone? My name is Potato and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto Online video. Today we're going to be going over covering, talking about, and taking a look at some of the new features that we're going to be seeing in the 2014 Holiday Season DLC for GTA 5. Now, uh, before we get started with the video, I would just like to quickly encourage you guys to leave a like if you do go on to enjoy the video and subscribe if you haven't done so already. That way you never miss out on an upload. And I also want to say one more thing. Uh, I got all this information from a very reputable source on the 7 Sins forum, which I'm going to link down below. And with all that said now the way, let's go ahead and get started. So, uh, also, I, I want to say that a lot of this actually applies to the current generation uh, version of GTA 5. And sadly, the, the last generation, if you guys are still on Xbox 360 and PS3, uh, you're not going to be seeing some of these features. However, uh, Rockstar is compensated for that, and what you guys aren't getting was some other cool things. So, uh, the reasoning behind that, and some of you guys are probably going to ask, is due to the fact that the last generation consoles can't really, I guess you could say, aren't really compatible with what were, or what the, the newer generation consoles, uh, of course, can handle. So, it's not the fact that Rockstar wants you to go out and buy GTA 5 in a new console. It's just due to the processing power and the capabilities uh, of what the last generation can do and withstand. So, uh, the first thing we're going to be seeing, and this is on next, or current generation only, excuse me, is gradient controlled snow. Now, this is really cool. What it means is basically you're going to see more snow. Uh, on Christmas Day or Christmas morning, for example, then you're going to see towards the end of Christmas Day. So, uh, that's very interesting. I'm really cool to or, excuse me, I'm very excited to see, if you can't tell already, how this is going to work out. Basically, uh, I, I guess it would be like during the day or, or the morning, there's going to be more ice on the road. There's going to be more snow for you to drive through uh, and things like that. And then, of course, towards the end of the day, it's going to start to melt and go down a little bit. And on the old generation or the last generation, we're only going to be seeing just the normal standard snowfall that we did see in 2013, of course. So, uh, you guys are still getting snowfall. It's still going to work the same, but it's just going to be a little bit easier to drive on and whatnot. Now, on both generations of consoles, we're going to be seeing eight brand new Christmas-themed clothing items ranging from scarves, t-shirts, suit jackets, pumps, suit trousers, uh, etc. So, this is really cool. I'm guessing it's going to... Uh, kind of be like what we got last year with like Santa Claus themed clothing and uh, elf clothing and just things like that. Now, uh, what what's up next is a really, really cool feature that's only for the current generation, of course. Now, this is a one time limited Christmas themed apartment interior. So uh, this is really cool. I'm really looking forward to this and how it's going to look. I'm guessing we're going to see a Christmas tree, uh, Christmas lights, maybe a mistletoe wreaths on the doors and uh, overall, just things like that. So, uh, on the old generation, of course, since you guys aren't going to be getting the new interiors, what you are going to be getting, though, is discounts on selected apartments. So, uh, that's really cool, and I think that that's just really a good deal. Uh, of course, since, like I said, the uh, the older generations uh, of consoles can't really withstand what uh, a new interior would hold. So, the, I'm guessing Rockstar would have to remove all of the interiors and just put this Christmas-themed one in there. Now, uh, the next thing we're going to be getting is one exclusive Cops and Crooks mission, which is part of the heist uh, uh, variant, or, or the heist portion, excuse me, uh, of this update. So, that's going to be really cool. It's not going to be the only Cops and Crooks mission we're going to see. We're going to be seeing more, but this is an exclusive one. Now, uh, lastly, on the next or the current generation, I keep wanting to say next generation, and I apologize, but we're going to be seeing a red sky effect during the snowfall. So, if any of you guys have ever seen snowfall uh, sometime uh, during your life, it, you've noticed at some points during the day there is a red sky effect, and I'm guessing that's what we're going to be seeing. It's not the sun. But it's just the, the sky is kind of a, a darker red outside. So uh, that's going to be really cool. And overall, this update just seems really, really cool. Probably one of the best ones that we're going to get this year. Now, it's going to release on December 23rd, 2014 with the Heist DLC for all platforms. So that's something to look forward to. But with all that said out of the way, I believe that's just about it for the video. If you guys, of course, did enjoy and would like to see more like it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new around here and haven't done so already. And with all that sent out of the way, I believe that's just about it. You guys all take it easy, have a safe one, and I will talk to you later. Bye.